I'm hungry. What does that have to Can we just I start eat? <laughs> What's up, Divas and Divos? It's your girl, April, and guest. You're an idiot. <laughs> okay. So, anyway, me and Nay are back to do another Rose Gal video. So, if you guys seen us in the same attire already, it's because we did two try on videos today and we're going to get them all done and squared away because I'm hungry. And what are you doing <laughs> with those stupid slippers? Look at his legs. Okay, go. <laughs> So anyway, you guys know all about Rose Wholesale. Excuse me, Rose Gal. They do have a sister website called Rose Wholesale. And Demis and Zafu and Dressily and Twinkle Deals and Sammy Dress and any other one that I did not mention. They are all affiliate websites and they are located in China. However, some of your items do come from... Slow down. I don't even know anymore, <laughs> okay? Like I was saying, she is definitely throwing me off. So... I don't want to go into the whole spiel of what you need to do, but I'm just going to tell you guys real quick so that you do know what you got to do. Make sure that you measure yourself prior to ordering anything. You can write it down in a book, okay? But look at the size chart for each garment of clothing because if you don't, you'll be like stuck with something that definitely doesn't fit and you'll be so upset. And if you move those freaking Yoshi slippers <laughs> one more time, I'm going to kill you with them, okay? So also the time frame for each item is three day processing, five to ten day processing, and so is fifteen day processing. Okay. You're sitting there looking like a bag lady. Well, all that stuff on you, okay? If you order a bunch of stuff, your items will come at different times because of the processing time frame. And then you'll be sitting there looking like a bag lady, holding your stuff like your this is your last items and your worldly goods. So anyway, we're gonna get into this video because Nay is driving me crazy. I'm gonna smack her with those. You <laughs> I was getting ready to talk about that. Nobody said you can talk yet. So anyway. There are some things that I did not try on for this video. And um, it's just because I didn't want to. Um, because it didn't fit. Okay, so the first thing that I'm going to show you guys is this bralette. So it's a 2X and it came to me really, really big. It was way too big. I got in a size 16. And so it didn't have snaps or bra hook on the back. So I cut it open and made some because it was just like really big. There was no way that I was going to be, a, I'm going to smack you to fit this. Um, and then even when I put it on, it still just, it didn't stay down in the front. It just was not for me. It's really cute, but it just didn't fit properly. So unfortunately this, I should have ordered a size smaller, but also I don't think like the straps was very beneficial because they weren't stretched. So it kind of like stiffened the entire outfit up and made it pull. And then I also did not try on um, these jeans because I actually got them from Rose Go Rose Gal before, prior, which are these ultra or low rise um, stretch jeans. These are really cute jeans and I actually have two pair of them. So I gave a pair to my daughter Tati and I do like them a lot. So, so go ahead, girlfriend. What I have is my Duke's slippers. My slippers are cute. They're Yoshi slippers. Um... Put them by my face one more time. Hey, muffins. Okay. <laughs> I like them. I like them because my feet get really cold, and that's the worst part about my like the coldest thing. Like, like, like I just hate when my feet get cold because you don't never warm up if your feet are cold. That's why I sleep yeah. with socks. And on. then my you don't sleep with socks on. No. I'll take them off in the middle of the night, but my feet have to warm up first. I, I cannot know, sleep. sleep like that because I'm like that is so feet. not comfortable. No. <laughs> I like socks. I hope Luna bites them up. Don't sit. They're cute though. What do you think about them? They're cute. They're comfortable. His legs are really cute though. I'm going to cut them off while she's sleeping. I'm going to take her slippers and I'm going to hide them then. Well, should you not? Um, you didn't model that freaking purse book bag. I didn't take off my bunnies. 
Yeah, because she thinks that she could carry a, her books in a purse instead of a book bag. My binders fit in my back hurts looks, after a while. That looks so uncomfortable to carry her. It's not. That, just, you, that thing is going to be heavy. She's got two freaking rabbits on the side. This hanging. is not heavy. This is show not heavy. Show the bag off. Show them, you, you show them the back of it. This one looks like it's on the inside. I see my binders fit. My binder and my papers fit. All I put is my binder in here because that's all I had. Oh, okay. my pencil. Okay. And it's a, it's a, like a rustic color brown. Yeah, it's really cute. This is the only one I found on their website, like with like the strap thing on it, and that was big enough to fit I my mind. I have bags it. like that that you can have. Yeah, but I mean, yeah. that's you your your bags. Bags. Oh, Well, I don't carry them. I don't care. You have fur on one of your bags in the closet. It's a bag. It's a fur bag. It's a, you want to carry that one? I don't look like a. That's a like a no. <laughs> you could you could attach your rabbits to it. No, it's, the purse, it's really nice. It's really cute. I like it. I like that I can fit just my binder in here because that's all I wanted to fit. It's just my binder. After all, carrying books for no reason in a backpack along with like a bunch of papers hurts at my back after a while. And then the straps end up that straps end up like ripping, and then this digs into your shoulders though. No, I don't carry it for too long because I'm just I have five minute passing period and I carry. It. So we got anything else over here you didn't try on? So I have this Christmas shirt. It's after Christmas. And yes, I'm going to show you guys. And I thought it was cute. And then when I got it, I was like, oh, why would they put this on it? Okay. I just patched on it right here, right? And it was right here. And it said, too sweet. So I was like, why would they put this on the shirt? So then I ripped it off. And it said 2016. It's Christmas. Merry Christmas. So, I mean, it's cute. I would still wear it regardless of the year, you know what I'm saying? But, but, they um, said 2000. I know they then. did. That was real s sneaky. But it was still cute. Other than that, yeah, it was still super cute. The one of the clothing items I have is um, just a basic uh, orange cutout shirt with at the arms and it's like a cutout crop top. Are you kidding me? A joke. No, it got a hole in it right there. Wow, I'll fix it. Yeah, it's cute. Um, really nice. The color is really great. Um, she thought it looked like a pumpkin, though. No, I didn't. You I said, said it if you put it with black jeans, uh, that would look like you look like a pumpkin. I like it though. It's I still cute. wore black jeans with it though. Did you? Yeah. I didn't even pay you no attention. You were recording me the whole time. I wasn't really paying you attention. <laughs> well, how did it fit? It fit really nice. It really well. I like it. It's cute. It's different. I think it's cute. So I love camouflage anything. I don't know why. I never, I don't know. I just think it's sexy. And I was so excited about this shirt. Like, yes, yes. But it was like, no, no. Because it was, it was tight. It was like kind of tight on me. It's a double XL. It was kind of tight. Like, I like my sleeves to be long. Like, so it wasn't, it wasn't sleeve expectations for me. Like, I need my sleeves to be like, past my wrist not like right here because then I feel like I have on somebody else's shirt the hood is good um it has some po a pocket in the front I would have probably been cool with that but it is stretchy and I do like the lace up in the front it reminds me of this camouflage t-shirt that I got which is like this too um the material is nice and you know like durable but I really just wish that the sleeves was a little bit longer because they feel kind of a little bit tight in the sleeve area but other than that it's still cute because I love camouflage I will wear this with my leggings. My next um, shirt is uh, just a jean feel off the shoulder uh, top. It's really cute. I thought it was cute. It is cute. I like it because it's a ruffled shirt. Mm -hmm. Very, very trendy. Very nice. Nice and trendy. And did it stay down? Mm hmm. Yep. Lucky you. Yeah, you I like it. I thought it was nice. It's really cute. You have a lot of off the shoulder shirts. You like your shoulders sexy, huh? Which is trendy. See, this is how I be feeling about my shoulder stuff. Shoulders, well, I don't really. The reason why I don't really care for both of them off the shoulder sometimes is the reason why I'm about to tell you. But the denim is cute, though it's not heavy, so I think it looks cute, especially with the white jeans that you put on with it. Reminds so what I was referring to was this off the shoulder denim dress. It is super cute. 
Um, the only issue I had is it kept rising up over my shoulder. Also, um, it did not come with the red belt that you see me wearing with it because I felt like if I didn't have one this red belt, I would have looked like I was wearing a potato sack. It is a double XL. The buttons in the front do not open. They're just for show, like pretend like they do. Okay, they don't. I do like the fact that the sleeves um, do tie, but Nay tied my left arm so tight that I thought I was going to pass out doing photo shoots. But you're what? the one who zippered me up in my jacket with like, the buttons all on my neck. Yeah, that was because you already did my arm like this. That was payback. But it's a very nice lightweight denim. I just need for this to stay on the shoulders. And I really think that they should have included like some type of belt with it. So I really would highly suggest if you don't like that potato sack look, then definitely put on a belt with it. I've decided to pair with a red one because that's what I had in my closet. I don't even know where the red belt came from, but it did definitely bring out the roses in the dress. So it was a perfect, perfect fit. Okay. My last thing is um just this olive a bomber jacket. I thought it was really cute. I didn't. Realize, I think it's cute too. I didn't realize they had the the flag. Yeah, on the strip on the back. I have, and I like the way you paired it with that. It's cute. Mm -hmm. And it has the zippers on the sides. It's quilted. Don't zipper it up. Nay says never zipper your jacket up, especially if you want to be cute. So if you're freezing cold outside and you still want to be cute, don't zipper your jacket up. Don't. Especially a bomber jacket. That's just weird. Don't zipper a bomber jacket. Don't listen to Nay because if you do, you'll be sick. So don't listen to her. Cute. I like the the, the arm on the inside. Yeah, because it was really cute. It's really comfy. Really comfortable. Very very warming. Hmm, very warm. So I reordered this because you guys see me wear this in another video and it was a size 14. It was too tight. It gave me like camel toe and this one almost did too in that area too, but just don't look at that. Um, it zippers on the side and I love this outfit. I really do. It's a romper. It's one piece. The only thing is it's very plungy in the front. So you definitely have to put something there so that it'll stay close. But I love this so much that I got it a size up and it fits perfectly. And it's funny thing about this. It just like really snatches in your waist. Girl, you will look like you have the perfect figure ever. This is like the perfect like romper. I don't really know where I'm going to wear this to. It's like super cute. And it's just like, this was like one of my favorite outfits from Rose Gal. I better if the zipper was a little bigger. Oh, Nay doesn't like the zipper on um, the so handle small. because it's so small. And then it hurts your fingers after a while. Your butt. So I love this dress. I mean, this this romper. It's like bomb. I just wish that the front wasn't so plunging. But it and then also I do have this um, pink, um, I don't know, long shirt and it has splits in the middle. I gave it to my daughter. I didn't really like it on me because it was just so fitting and it just showed my rolls and stuff and I don't like stuff like that. So I did like it paired with the white jeans but it just really wasn't for me. I just don't like stuff that has a split right there in the middle. And I'm like, I felt kind of awkward. Like what am I supposed to do with this piece in the middle? What am I supposed to do with this piece? And also I just didn't like the material of it, especially because I have rolls and it just made my rolls so noticeable and I'm very, very like self-conscious. But the color pink was so pretty. Um, that is the reason why I got it. And it isn't a double XL, but it does run very, very small. So, yes. And then the last thing you see me in is this dress. Um, the reason why I'm so close up is because I have my leggings on. And I didn't feel like taking them off because I almost forgot about the dress. The buttons don't unbutton. Only, like to a certain point which is like here to the waist but it's cute it's very homely looking um, you can definitely jazz it up it is a size 2xl the pink is so pretty and the material is made very well the sleeves do cinch or you can just pull the sleeves up on the sides if you want to and there are two breast pockets I'm not really like a huge fan of breast pockets I just don't like pockets on my breast either way it's still really cute I mean I guess if you wanted to wear leggings with it you can or you can just still make it really really jazzy depending on what you wear with I'm pretty sure that you can make this dress look really cute. But the, the color pink is like really pretty cotton candy color pink. So, so you guys, that's about it for our try on haul. We just kind of all over the place. I hope you guys enjoyed it as much as we enjoy spending time with you guys. And on that note, we hope you guys had a great day. Stay diva and delicious. Make sure you rate, comment, subscribe. Thumbs this video up because you love us. And on that note, I'm getting out of here because I'm hungry and I got weeks to do. What about you? You got games to play. See you guys later.